What's up, YouTube? Back with another video from Right Around the Storm. Uh, hope everyone had a good holiday. Today is Christmas. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video. Uh, I was out driving my truck around a little bit earlier, and I wanted to address something, and that's snow drifting. Uh, lots of people do it, but there are some things that you need to do and do not do. The first one is don't do it on the street. You're not Ken Block. Nobody's that good. You're going to hit something. Parked car, a curb, street sign, mailbox, guardrail, jersey barrier, you name it. You're going to hit something sooner or later. Nobody is that good. So if you're going to do it, you need to do it in somewhere controlled. I'm not advising you to do any of this, but if you're going to do it, you need to go to not a school, not any business, not a truck stop. Uh, I hypothetically went to uh, a public park. I was out before closing hours so that I wasn't trespassing. So you need to make sure you follow all the laws and rules and everything. But driving in the snow, and especially drifting around in the snow, is one of the best ways to learn car control. It's one of the best ways to learn how much traction the car will or will not have, depending on if you have a front-wheel drive, all-wheel drive, or a pickup truck. And a pickup truck, if you're planning on driving in the snow, you need to have some weight in the back. So without further ado, Here's some videos of uh, 22 feet long, 6,000 pounds, big block, Chevy Dually sliding around the snow. Peace.